and welcome to another episode called Roly Poly Oli. Never heard of it, never seen it. Um, my assumption when I think of the show of Roly Poly Oli is bugs. Like, you know, like the Roly Poly Oli bugs. Let's go. Oh, okay. <laughs> Teapot? Okay, this is not about bugs. This is a this is a robot. <laughs> I like the theme song. <laughs> I love it. It's catchy. It's a catchy theme song. Oh my gosh. They're all happy. I'm happy too. Howdy. Hooray! <laughs> Wait, is that mom flossing? <laughs> is that mom flossing? <laughs> oh my gosh, I already love it. <laughs> oh, we're talking about cookies. I have experience. Oh my! Jeez, do the cookies! Why does all cookies? <laughs> what? Why does all their Furniture have eyes. <laughs> they got faces. Yes, cookies. <laughs> Don't drop the cookies. A noki doki. <laughs> so I take that as no. You know what? I'm gonna say that for now on. When someone says no, I'm gonna be like, noki doki. <laughs> like doki doki. Look at that, look at that, the dog. Look at the dog bed, it, it has eyes. That's creepy, the, the bed. What? What? <laughs> every, every furniture and stuff has faces. That's kind of creepy. Oh my gosh, where are the cookies? What the heck? That's rigged. It was, it was the, I assume the grandpa or the uncle ate them? That's my thing. I think it's the grandpa. It is bad. Someone ate all the cookies. There's no cookies for you. Maybe it was the dog. I have a feeling it was the dog. <laughs> They're just like every blinking. I just can't stop thinking about the furniture and your dental's just like with their eyes. <laughs> wow, he's got some big eyes. It's so weird. I'm a bed with eyes and watches you sleep. <laughs> Still can't think about that. <laughs> this kind of reminds me of Mickey Mouse cartoons. <laughs> the vacuum with the eyes. <laughs> Look at, is that a plunger? Was that a plunger? Was that a plunger with eyes and a mouth? <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. They're just tickling the dad. <laughs> Yeah, it was the mom. Cookies. Technically, it was the mom because she was the one that like told him to like cool off and stuff. Wow, what was that? That was pretty fancy. You know what this show reminds me of? Has anybody seen Meet the Robinsons? It, this show reminds me, it would inspire this movie. Or robots. Robots. Has anybody seen robots? It reminds me of that too. Robots and um and go to Aspire, meet the Robinsons. It really reminds me of this. Even the TV has eyes, everything has eyes. Imagine if that's the future, guys. So like this chair behind me has eyes. <laughs> Even the door, the door has eyes. Oh, it was the dog. Didn't I call that? I knew it was the dog. I knew it was the dog. I knew it. Technically that's bad for dogs to eat cookies. Yes, chocolate chip cookies. Definitely want to recommend my niece and nephew to watch this show. It's awesome. Ew. Ew. What is that? <laughs> Belly bulbs. What the heck? Okay. Remember how that when you were a kid and you were like, you have to eat your vegetables. This is why kids didn't want to eat their vegetables. So is Telly like a name of something, someone? Who call, who names it Telly? I just call it TV. Dude, watch the fork have eyes too. Dude, put some like dressing or something like that. Don't eat it plain. That's just torturing yourself. 
He is really not enjoying that Brussels sprout. I've actually had Brussels sprout. It's actually really good. Hey, look at that. Look at that pot or the, the, yeah, it's gonna, it's looking at the, ew, what the heck? Oh, that's weird. You just told a lie. Oops. <laughs> Yo, look at this TV. Actually, Brussels sprouts are really good. You just gotta add flavor. Look at that chair. That chair's like, how long do I have to be here until I am broken? <laughs> have a smile on his face. <laughs> what? That is nightmare fuel. What? While they're enjoying their ice cream, he's like turning in like to, to a Brussels sprout chairs. He didn't even eat it. <laughs> Dude, he didn't even eat the last Brussels sprout. Oh, there's the teapot house. <laughs> that teapot house is creepy. Man, is this the future? Like robots are gonna take over Earth and then they're gonna just have all their um, <laughs> appliances have eyes and a mouth? Uh, Elvis? <laughs> Whoa! Um, what? What? It's pretend hair. <laughs> yeah. Okie dokie. Dude, balling. Oh, man. NBA skills. Balling. <laughs> Who's this guy? <laughs> Who's this guy? He's a squat. He's a a rectangle. <laughs> no, a cube! That's a cube. I thought that was a retina. That's a cube. Oh, look, it's Elvis. <laughs> he even talks like Elvis. <laughs> what? Oh, wow, that's skill. Harlem Globetrotter status right there. Blanky bonk. some mad skill right there guys boom bowling still that still house is so creepy the house is literally looking at them that is creepy what i am so glad i don't have that in my room of that clock that would literally creep me out ah yes i used to do that all the time when i was a kid yeah like you were like superman also you notice like the bouncing like eek, the sound of it when they it's kind of cool. I like it. I like it. Oh my gosh. Poor dog. That's an awful wig if that wig keeps going all around. Wow, even the tree has eyes. <laughs> Look at the tree. Look at the tree. <laughs> Reminds me of the tree from Kirby. <laughs> kind of interesting because those, those objects don't talk, but they have a mouth and eyes. <laughs> <laughs> it's Elvis Robot. <laughs> oh, wow. Now it's actually staying on? Really? <laughs> it's so weird. <laughs> That's so weird. <laughs> what? <laughs> Dude, this room looks so creepy. There's so much furniture. Oh, my God. Gosh, that's so creepy of the bed looking at him. Wow. I don't even know what that is. Jeez. Robosaurus? What? How <laughs> much is dinosaurs, but they're robots. Welcome to Robosaurus Park. <laughs> Life finds a way. <laughs> and they may make a movie of it. And maybe a sequel. The dog does better, to be honest, digging. Look at that hose. The hose is so weird. Oh, why would you drink out of a hose? <laughs> wow, that's just weird. <laughs> it's just a bone. Wow, that's kind of a cool, wow! That was crazy with the hand. 
<laughs> oh, oh snap. We're gonna get some um, music. Oh, this should be cool. Are they all gonna play together? Okay. Now, if I saw this in real life, I would probably freak out. <laughs> this is some good music. Oh, wow. He ruined, he, Spot ruined it. Oh my gosh, they're all going insane. Yo, okay, we getting some like Avengers vibes? <laughs> I think that's it. All right, guys. <laughs> that was Broly Poly Ole. I think, yeah, that show came out, um, I think like in the late 90s to early 2000s, but I liked it. It was cute. It was a cute kid's show. I, I know my uh, nieces and nephew would love this show if I were to show them like this show and stuff. I thought it was really cool. I liked the concept of, I completely thought it was gonna be different because when I saw Roly Poly Oli, I thought it was gonna be about bugs, you know, because of Roly Poly Oli's are bugs. But I liked, I really liked um, the fact that it, was like robots and stuff like that. The thing that was a little creepy though was all the objects like having eyes and a mouth. I thought that was a little creepy um, just because I'm not used to that, seeing that like every day. But I like the vibes that this show was going at. It had a message for each episode and it was very fun and very uplifting and I know a lot of kids especially around like the younger age groups really are you know would really enjoy this and I really enjoyed it as well um like it was like I said I like the funness of it and just like the positive kind of vibes that it had along with the messages and stuff that was very uh interesting and stuff the only probably hard critique I would say about this show was just uh, like the objects, like uh, just having eyes. Cause I kept commenting like, oh my gosh, they got like eyes. Like, oh my gosh, it's like creepy. Um, Cause I'm not used to that. But other than that, I thought the animation, especially for this time was really good. It was really solid. Um, I probably got to give this show an eight out of 10. I would have gave it, given this show probably a little bit higher, close to a perfect score, or like a 9 out of 10, or even a 10 out of 10, but just the um, the objects kind of like having faces kind of just like creeped me out a bit. So, but I would give this a solid 8 out of 10. Voice actors, the voice actors that voiced all the, get di all the different characters were really, really good. Um, the animation was really good as well. I love kind of like the plot, the setting that it's at. And yeah, just like the fun vibes, even just like by watching the theme song. I love the theme song. So yeah, I'm gonna give this an eight out of 10. I'm probably gonna, I'm probably gonna show my nieces and nephew this show because it looks really, really cute and stuff, especially like I would have never guessed this was a Disney uh, this was uh, put on by Disney. I would have never have guessed that. But what are you guys' thoughts? Growing up, uh, did you guys watch Roly Poly Oli? Because I really wish that I watched this show growing up. I think I would have loved uh, this show. I think it had like a couple seasons and stuff. Um, but yeah, like, what are your guys' thoughts? Do you guys like Roly Poly Oli? And have you guys seen it? Um, this is another episode, guys, of us reacting to our, to a first reaction show. So I really appreciate all the love, and thank you for watching this episode. And, uh, yeah, stay tuned for the next episode, and peace out, guys.